After almost 12 months behind bars, one of South Korea's former presidents, Im Yong Bak, was granted bail on Wednesday as the trial over his alleged corruption and bribery charges rumbles on. The court made sure to lay down some tough ground rules for the former leader. Oh Si Young reports. Former President Im Yong Bak was released on bail on Wednesday, almost a year after he was jailed on corruption charges. The Seoul High Court approved a conditional release after E's attorney sought bail for health reasons. While rejecting claims of E's illness, the court said it considered the fact that E's appeals trial is unlikely to wrap up before his detention period ends next month. Without a house arrest, E would be freed without any conditions, which could risk him tampering with evidence. In exchange for the $886,000 bail, E has agreed to stay within the confines of his residence. He has also been banned from meeting or communicating with anyone other than his immediate family and legal team. Hospital visits will also have to be approved. He was sentenced to 15 years in prison after a lower court in October last year found him guilty of owning an auto parts company, creating an $11 million slush fund, as well as taking bribes from Samsung in return for the release of its chairman, Igoni. The 77-year-old has denounced the allegations as political retaliation by the country's liberals and has sought an appeal on his prison term ever since. Yi served as South Korea's president from 2008 to 2013. His successor, Park geun was also jailed and sentenced after a massive corruption scandal resulted in her impeachment. Oh Soo-young, Arirang News.